beautiful people, it's Yana, and I'm back today with yet another video. And you guys, today's video is gonna be another scary one, so I hope you're ready. Turn down the lights, get your blankets, get your snacks, and prepare to get spooked because this video is titled, It Was Born During the Night. That title alone sounds really terrifying. So if you guys are excited for this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into it. So for this episode, we were contacted by a girl named Lucy who is concerned because her mom, Gloria, became pregnant and she thinks her mom conceived the baby in an unnatural way. Lucy thinks that if her mom gives birth, there's going to be something horribly wrong with the baby. She isn't even sure how her mom became impregnated and since carrying this child, her mom has become animalistic and started smelling really bad. Okay, so ever since this girl's mom got mysteriously pregnant, she's been smelling really bad. In the email, the daughter also mentions that she's been acting really animalistic, but I guess it is very concerning to her daughter, so she is emailing them for help. She sent us this video for proof. Now Lucy thinks her mom is going to give birth soon and she needs our help convincing her not to go through with the childbirth or something horrible will be born. So tonight, we're going to drive to their house and see what's going on with this family. After seeing that clip, I am very convinced there is something wrong with her mom. She was literally standing in the kitchen, just slamming the oven door open and closed over and over and over again. Like, okay, babe, you're definitely losing it a little bit if you're doing all that. Not to mention the way she looked over at the camera. Oh my God, that was really scary. Bro, why are we getting involved with this family? Her mom's pregnancy is none of our business. Because Lucy says her mom has become unstable. It's not right to leave this girl alone with her. But there's nothing we can do about that. And what if her mom is dangerous? Dude, I think Lucy's just exaggerating. She's probably jealous this new baby is going to take her mom's attention away from her. Not them going into this already assuming that she's just over-exaggerating the entire thing. His theory is that she is jealous of the new baby coming and that's why she's like making up all this stuff. It's still very early on so I'm not too sure but I guess it could be a possibility. However, the way that her mom looked in that clip that she sent over, it was definitely not good and not normal. So regardless, something must be wrong with her mom. It's called sibling jealousy. Bro, you don't have a psychology degree. And what are we going to do when it's time for her mom to give birth? You don't need a piece of paper to help someone. Let's just drive there and find out more about the situation. <sighs> okay. As always, they don't really agree on going to this place, but they do want to help the girl out and really get to the bottom of what the hell is going on here. Is the mom's pregnancy really bizarre and unnatural? Or is the daughter literally just exaggerating the entire thing? I guess we're about to find out. Your destination is on the right. All right. We're here. Let's go knock and talk to the daughter. Okay. Hey, uh, I know this is weird, but your daughter emailed us. She says she's concerned about you. No, that was me. I emailed you. Wait, so your mom is pregnant? Yes, she's extremely pregnant. <laughs> well, can we come in and see her? Yeah, she's in the other room. Follow me. Okay, come on. Dude, how old is her mom? 
Okay, right off the bat, we have a huge problem. When they knocked on that door, I 100% expected like a young girl in her 20s to come out. And I think it's safe to say we were all shocked when we saw that a much older woman opened the door. And I mean, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that other than the fact that that must mean that the pregnant mom has to be even older, making her very old. So what the hell is really going on here? Things are getting very confusing. No! What? She was just there. <gasps> She's gone? Well, where did she go? I don't know. She's really unstable tonight. Hold on. Chester, where are you going? We just gotta go to the car. Going so soon. <gasps> What's over you, there? Come on. You can't leave now. I'm baking you my special cookies. Is that her mom? Yeah. So as he was gonna go get something from his car, out comes the pregnant mom talking about baking cookies and looking very, very pregnant. Not to mention she is using a very creepy voice. I was definitely not expecting that. All right, well, we need to sit down and talk with them. Bro. <laughs> Cookies, sweetie. Those are the cookies that she was talking about. I mean, I'm not crazy, right? There's literal huge clumps of hair in the cookies. That is actually extremely nauseating to look at. Comment down below, would you ever eat hair cookies? Because, oh my goodness, I know I would not get anywhere near those things. Oh, they look so disgusting. These go against every single thing a cookie stands for. Okay, can you please sit down now? Okay, ladies. Thank you for sitting down. It's my pleasure. Yeah, so Lucy, you emailed us because you're concerned about your mother Gloria's pregnancy. This isn't natural. She's 78 years old. I don't know how this happened. Um, have you tried asking her how she conceived this baby? How could I ask her? She lost her mind years ago. Hey, Mom, how did you get pregnant? <laughs> well, you see, dear, your father and I loved each other very much. Dad's been dead for 10 years, Mom. I'm starting to get under the impression that something paranormal is going on here. This woman is 78 years old. She should absolutely not be pregnant. The poor daughter seems very freaked out and doesn't really know what to do. I mean, I can't blame her. Like, what do you even do in this situation? It's quite a sticky one to be in. Gloria, this isn't natural for you to have a baby at this age. Can you please tell us, how did you become pregnant? What is that? Oh dear, it seems like my water broke. Dude, my socks are getting wet. Lucy, I think your mom is going into labor. You need to help us get her set up. Oh yeah, uh, I have something for her, my car. Dude, where's she going? Things escalated very, very quickly because she literally just went into labor. Out of nowhere like this, her water broke. Chester. I think she's coming right back. That means she's going into labor. Bro, I don't even think that. What? Hello, boys. Gloria, your water broke. We gotta get you set up. You're gonna have your baby. Hmm. Do you two wanna do a puzzle? A puzzle? Gloria, are you ready to give birth now? Ah, not yet. 
I have to find some games for us to play. So the daughter straight up abandoned them as soon as her water broke. She's like, I gotta go get something from the car and then straight up just dipped. And then you have pregnant grandma over here trying to play games and puzzles while she's in labor. My brain is literally gonna explode what is going on. This old lady's nuts. Let's just go to her car. Bro, sooner or later, she's gonna give birth. If she's actually having a baby, we need to be here to make sure it's born properly. <laughs> but she's too old to have a baby. And why would her daughter leave? There's something sick going on here. Yeah, that's what we're trying to find out. I'm gonna set up some cameras to record her, and then let's go to sleep. Excuse me, the fact that her water broke and now he is literally squeezing it out of his sock. So it looks like they're gonna set up cameras to try to get to the bottom of what is going on here. And I mean, she's in labor. It's not like they can just leave her there alone. And the daughter fully bailed. So they kind of have to just stick around and see this through to the end. However, I'm sure that the cameras they set up are gonna catch some crazy stuff they always do. This grandma is definitely a little crazy, just a little bit. Horrendous. That's probably the scariest thing I've seen this entire video. There is so much hair in those cookies that they are all linked together like a big hair cookie chain. That is quite literally what nightmares are made of. The way her neck bent out of shape like that was not normal at all. And she seems to have disappeared from her rocking chair. So if I were these guys, I would wake up very soon. Things are about to go down. Whoa, I did not expect to see the grandma crawling on all fours. I guess that's what the daughter meant when she said she was acting animalistic. Because yeah, girl, that does not look like a human being to me. She looks like some sort of human being monster hybrid. understand how they're not waking up from all the noise that she's making. I mean, she's quite literally banging her head up against a freaking door. Not to mention the way she's walking and crawling around the house like an actual animal. It seems like she shapeshifted because she does not look the same like she looked during the day. I don't know if this is a thing that only comes out at night, but it is a very terrifying. Pregnant grandma is starting to freak me out. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Is she there? It's time for me to give birth now. Okay, the way she was banging on their door, I did not expect her to be this calm when they came out. But I guess it's time for her to give birth now. This is the moment we have been waiting for and the moment they've been waiting for because they need to figure out what this baby is. Especially now that she yelled out, I am the vessel. It's starting to make me think even more that this is something paranormal and she is being used as a vessel to give birth to some sort of like monster or demon or something like that. I don't know, it's just a theory. I could be wrong, but comment down below what you think because I'm pretty sure we're about to find out. I think she's in here. Okay. Oh my god! Whoa, what is all this? This is where she's gonna have the baby. Nicole, you gotta help me deliver it. Wait, they're actually going to deliver the baby themselves? Okay, this is absolutely insane. Also, that makeshift delivery room looks absolutely terrifying. What an absolutely not nice and comfortable place to give birth. It's okay. How long is your water gonna bring? It's okay, it's okay. It hurts, it hurts, it hurts. before they even go and see what the hell just popped out of her, I think that is the most insane sequence I've seen ever. I don't think my brain can even process what I just saw. I think it is very clear by now that this woman is giving birth to some sort of monster. What is this stuff? The one in there! Alright! What's in there? It's gone! Wait, what? Where'd it go? confirm now that this woman didn't just give birth to a little monster or a little creature. She gave birth to like a seven foot gigantic monster. He started off like a little slug and then grew and grew and then turned into this huge thing. And now this Voldemort looking thing is chasing them throughout the house. I bet you this is not how they thought their night was gonna go. <laughs> I don't know. Did it follow us? There's something there. What? What are they doing?
you guys so that is the end of that video and oh my god what a crazy video it was basically at the end there whatever she gave birth to somehow crawled back into her and used her as a puppet to attack them which is really freaking crazy i don't even know how that works this is clearly some sort of like monster creature humanoid i mean i don't really know what it is but i know it's not human that's for sure comment down below what you guys thought of this video and if you enjoyed make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe i love you guys so much and i'll see you in the next one bye